Hi guys, I'm Manoj and in this video we'll have a look at GitHub Student Developer Pack, the features that come along with it and the application process. So let's get started. Okay, the first thing you get along with the developer pack is a GitHub Pro. Uh, you get all the features uh, that come with GitHub Pro. Um, as you can see mentioned over here, the features of GitHub Pro. Um, the first thing is GitHub uh, support via email, whereas for the free one, you can get uh, support via community. And the second one is a 3000 GitHub Action Manage, whereas for the free one, it's 2000. Uh, the third one is uh, 2 GB GitHub packages storage, whereas for the free one, I guess it's 500 MB. It's almost four times uh, more than the free one. And you get some advanced tools and insights in private repositories along with all these. Uh, you get uh, more uh, stuff. You can read it if you want. And the next thing is you will be eligible to apply for the GitHub's campus expert training. So let us now look into the application process. The first thing is you're going to type GitHub Education in Google and go into the first link. As you go into the link, uh, you will see this button here, GitHub Student Developer Pack. You're going to click on that. And the next step is you're going to click on this button, Get the Pack, and you're going to select Get Student Benefits. As you click on that button, a form appears uh, asking for all the basic stuff about your college and uh, your email ID and you need to submit some proof of your college identification and some uh, address uh, stuff and some uh, proofs about your college and your country etc and the most important thing is you need to have a .edu email address provided by your college or your working organization whatever and that's it that's the most important thing if you don't have it you cannot apply for the uh, student developer pack and after filling all these details you're going to click on this submit your information button so after submitting your application like around after one week you'll get this mail from github saying that you have been uh, approved your application has been approved for the developer pack and you get it if you don't get this uh, pack uh, this mail uh, you will probably get another mail saying that you have been rejected uh, the only reason for being rejected uh, would be like you may not uh, have provided the correct information or the correct email address uh, you need to provide the uh, educational email address if you provide normal uh, gmail or something uh, they will reject you so make sure that you mention your educational email address so that's it for this video i'll meet you in the next one hopefully Bye.